Hello everyone and welcome back. So first thing first, I just want to say the sound probably is awful on this video. This room that I am in is a temporary room, so it's echoing really bad. So in the future, I will not film in an empty room like this because it sounds pretty bad. But as of right now, it's all I can do and I definitely want to get some videos up for you guys. So I'm sorry for the echo. But today's video is going to be on my March and April favorites. Uh, I didn't do one in March because I didn't have enough to put in a video so I decided to combine the two months together and we had been moving at the beginning of May so that's why it's taken me so long to get this video up. But I am just going to get started. I want to preface this with it's a very girly favorites video so sorry these two months are really girly but I can't help what I like. I just like them and they're my favorites so here we go. I don't think I did this in my last video but if I did it's still my favorite. <laughs> this is my Naked 3 palette, Urban Decay. I think you guys know what Naked 3 is if you're watching YouTube videos. But it is these beautiful goldy pinks, corals, browns colors and it is absolutely stunning. I love it. It lasts for a very long time and I highly recommend it. And the second piece of makeup is my Urban Decay eyeshadow primer and this is the original color. This one kind of has like a nude tint to it with a, I don't want to say shimmer, shimmer is a bad word. But I put this on under my eyeshadow every day that I do wear eyeshadow and even some days when I don't wear eyeshadow because it does have like a flesh tone to it. And this stuff is amazing. It makes my eyeshadow last all day long. I highly recommend it and I actually got this one in another tube at Ulta this March? I think it was in March and it was like buy one get one free. They just had this random deal so I got two of these and I highly recommend them. They are wonderful and they make your eyeshadow last all day long and I love them. So if you want to check that out, go to Ulta or Sephora and try these out. They are so great. And my next favorite is this Almay lip gloss. It is called Nude, like N-U-D-E, <laughs> Nude Nutrients. And it's just a cute color. I have it on my lips right now. I think it's really fun for spring and summertime. And it lasts for a good amount of time. And I just really like the color, so it's on my favorites. And if you guys have watched my videos before, you've probably seen me use this eyeshadow. It is called Dainty. It is a mineralized blush by... MAC and as you can see it kind of has a shimmer to it. It's not like sparkly but it does have a pretty shimmer to it so you don't have to wear a highlighter with this and it's just a really pretty rosy color. If you're looking for a good blush try this one out. I want to try another shade next time I get some blush because I love it and it lasts all day. And my final piece of makeup today that I want to show you guys for my favorites is this Voluminous False Fiber Lashes and it's actually the waterproof kind because in Florida I sweat a lot or I glisten a lot. So um, this mascara is amazing. I have it on right now. I don't know if you guys can see, but it does not come off during the day. It doesn't chunk during the day, and I'm sure it would work in the non-waterproof one as well, but I just wanted to get waterproof because I knew I was going to be sweating a lot in Florida. And this is the blackish black color. I highly, highly, highly recommend this mascara. Try it. You'll love it. I promise. If you don't, send it to me in the mail and I'll use it. Ha! <laughs> just kidding. That's gross to use me. And one more piece of makeup, kind of, not really. I don't think I've ever actually mentioned these in a video. It's my Sigma Beauty Brushes, and I got these for Christmas from Josh. It was a total surprise. I have been wanting them for a long time, but I really didn't mention them recently. And he surprised me with these on Christmas. They are amazing. I don't really know what to say other than they're amazing. I love them. I use all of them. I mean, for different reasons, of course. But they're so amazing. They're so soft. They wash really well. They dry really well. They wear, like, they last. I mean, I've had them since. December and it's May and I mean they still look great. I do need to wash them, but they're amazing. The one I use the most is actually this um, eye shading E55 brush, but I mean I use this one every day. I mean they're just amazing. I really can't say enough about the Sigma brushes. So if you guys are looking for some brushes, it is an investment, but I will definitely keep them for a long time and I'll just keep them nice and clean. I just love them so much. They're beautiful. And now moving on to hair. I actually have this in my hair right now. It is Big Sexy Hair Root Pump, and I think I put this in a video before, but it was like a haul. I'm not sure, but I haven't put it in a favorites video, I don't think. But it is a mousse, but it sprays, so it's not like a pump mousse, it's a spray mousse, so it goes straight into your hair. You don't have to put it on your hands ahead of time. And I always just put this in the base at the top of my hair, so it gives me some volume. And when I blow dry my hair with this in it, oh my gosh, my hair is huge. So if you need some volume, I would definitely, definitely recommend this. I got my sister to try it because she has thin hair, and she said she really liked it as well. So if you're looking for some volume, definitely try the Big Sexy Hair Volumizing Spray Mousse. It is amazing. And next is the Bumble and Bumble Blow Dry Repair. 
And um, I actually got another one of these samples. It's probably gonna be my empties video too. This one is full. I got it when I got my hair cut um, in December and then I just got another one in May when I got it cut again. But the girl that cuts my hair is a Bumble and Bumble salon and she let me try this out and I put it in my hair before I blow dry it and it makes my hair so, so soft. It makes my hair feel soft and healthy and it just looks really, really good. I have it in my hair right now. I don't know if you can tell. But I really, really like it. If you have dryness in your hair, I would definitely recommend this. Or just if you want your hair to be feel soft and good and protected, try this. It's amazing. And next, this is kind of random, but I asked for this for Christmas because normally I wouldn't spend $20 on a hairbrush, but I think it was like $17.99 or $20. It is the Midnight Spornet 831, and it has these cute little diamonds in it. But I got this offline. And the reason I found out about it is because the little girl that I nanny for, I would always brush her hair with that brush. Her mom and her dad had that brush. So I found out about it and when I brushed her hair, I was like, man, this is a great brush. So I actually got it for Christmas and then when I went back for my last haircut, the girl who was cutting my hair had the same brush and she said she loves the brand, so it was a great brush. Somebody in the vlogs or on this channel was asking me about this brush. It is a great brush and I highly, highly recommend it. And moving right along with hair stuff, this is my Hot Tool Straightener. Now this is kind of random. I asked for a curling iron for Christmas, a one and one fourth inch curling iron. And it was actually buy the curling iron and get a straightener for free. It kind of worked out really well because my old straightener was seriously over five years old and it was on its last leg. And I love, 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 love hot tools. So you just turn it on and it shows you your temperature. You can choose your temperature. I don't really put it on that hot because you don't need that high of a heat to straighten your hair. Um, and it's actually got this really gorgeous purple color on the inside. I don't know if you can see it. But the thing I really like is because I travel a lot, or even just for everyday use, you can lock it in place so it doesn't open up, and then you can wrap it up. But it has a super long cord and the cord twist, which always helps because, you know, when you're straightening your hair, your cord gets tangled a lot, and it gets super hot. I recommend this for sure. And just keep an eye out on Ulta sales, and sometimes maybe you can get buy one, get one free. So I got this for free, and I love it. I will use it for years to come. I highly recommend any hot tools. In general, I love the brand and they are just excellent, excellent, excellent tools. And this is for your face. It is actually Hawaiian Tropic Sensitive Skin Facial Lotion and it's 50 SPF and I actually got this from Sean and Stephanie, um, Stephanie This Chapter. They gave it to me when I went and visited them and they live at the beach. Um, but they knew I had really sensitive skin so they told me to try this out and I love it. It works so, so well. It doesn't irritate my skin and it lasts all day. I did not get sunburned and I wore it from like 8 p.m. till like midnight So we went to a park one day and I wore this and it what lasted all day. So if you're looking for a good sunscreen for your face, try this Hawaiian Tropic Sensitive Skin Facial. It works really, really well. Okay, this is probably going to be my most random product of the day, but I think I've told some of you guys in the vlogs or even in the, on my channel before, but I really struggle with nausea really, really bad. So if you ever struggle with nausea, this is one of my favorite products. I use it almost every day. It's called Nausea, and it comes in these like little bitty pouches, and you can just get, I usually just take two at a time, and it instantly wipes out my nausea. Like less than five minutes, I feel a lot better. Usually two, you can take up to four, and I've been getting really car sick lately, or really motion sick, so this helps out with it a lot. I just get nauseous a lot, and this helps out a lot. I know it's so random, but it's one of my favorites, so I thought I would throw it in here. And my last tangible item, I guess tangible, is that the right word? Physical thing I can touch, what's that word? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about, is this. It is a battery charger, and we got it off Amazon. The brand is Anker, A-N-K-E-R, minus pink, Josh's is this black. It comes with this little button right here. You can turn it on, you can see it's green. Turn it off, turn it off. Nope, not gonna turn off. Anyways, you can turn it off, I promise. But uh, you just get like an iPhone cord, so I have, this is my iPhone cord. Oh, it's turned off now. That's my iPhone cord, I'll put it in, and if we're walking around the park or if I'm shopping out for the day, um, I can just charge my phone. I don't have to be connected to a wall or anything. It is so excellent when we go to the parks, when I go to the mall, when I go shopping, when I'm babysitting, whatever, because my phone usually doesn't last all day, so I can use this, and it definitely is a lifesaver. It comes with a little cord that comes on this end, and you can charge it um, just like with a, the, what you would use for your iPhone to charge it, and it doesn't take too long to charge. I usually just leave it sitting overnight, and then I'll use it the next day to charge my phone if my phone is not charged. Definitely recommend getting one of these. They are excellent. And uh, two apps that I want to say on my favorites. <laughs> the first one, I have heard it from Amy Puddles, and it's an air horn. And I love it. <laughs> it's one of my favorite apps. It's just like the best thing ever. So if you want to download it, it is called the Ham Horn. And if you ever need a horn, 
download the app, it's amazing. <laughs> And the next app is called Map My Run, and I have been getting into running and walking again lately. It is super hot in Florida, so I definitely have to do it in the evenings. I learned that today. I went during the heat of the day, and it was not a good decision. All you do is click Start My Workout, and it tracks where you go, and then um, it'll track like how long you walked for, how many miles, how many calories you burned. It is, I think it even has like um, watering stations, like where you can get water at, and it, you can like also like put um, today I sweated a lot, today I felt really good, today I couldn't run as long as normal like there's ways to track and journal everything and you can play music through the app so it's a really cool app and I highly recommend it and another one of my favorites is technically it's in May but we're gonna just add it to this one is my husband Josh he got me those flowers for our anniversary and our anniversary is May 5th so I wanted to throw that into this video and just tell him that I love him so much and him and I have been just having the best time since we moved to Florida we've really grown stronger over the past month which is ridiculous because we've only been here for a month but we have had the best time so far in Florida so I want to tell my husband that I love him so much and I'm so proud to be his wife and I'm proud of him for getting the job of his dreams and he's already succeeding at it and I'm so proud of him. And my last favorites of March and April, and this is actually one of my favorites of like all year, is you guys. You guys have been so great lately, just leaving really sweet comments. I feel like on Instagram you guys are like killing it lately. You've been following me on Instagram and leaving the nicest comments and just making me feel so, so loved and I don't know, I just really have felt like the community of my channel and of our vlogging channel lately has been super, super strong. So I wanted to say thanks to you guys for being so supportive of Josh and I and just being really, really supportive in the comments, no negative comments, um, and being supportive on Twitter and Instagram as well. And I don't know, I just really am thankful for YouTube and I'm excited to see where this channel goes. So yeah, that is all for my March, April favorites and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you real soon. Oh, don't forget to like the video and subscribe and share with your friends. Okay? Okay. <laughs> See you real soon. This is the first video that Lady is not in because she's not here. We're gonna have to find a picture of her real quick and I just need to show you. <laughs> Guys, Lady's not here. She's in Alabama right now with my mom because we can't have pets in this house. So we're, she's gonna move down soon. But I really need to show you all a picture of Lady because she's been in every video so far so she's just gonna have to be in this one. So here is a picture of Lady so we can have some lady, lady footage, but there's me and Lady on Thanksgiving and I miss her so much and she is my favorite puppy in the world. So Lady, you are in my March and April favorites. Anyways guys, see you real soon. Have a magical day. Bye! So as of April 11th, we moved to Florida. Yay! I'm so excited. We moved to Florida April 11th because Josh started the job at Disney. I'm so excited for him. I'm so proud of him. He got a full-time job at Disney and he is for the past month. Um, so I'm super proud of him and then as of last week, May 5th, I was walking down Main Street and I got the call and I'm a cast member again. Yay! So I have traditions tomorrow and then I will officially be a Disney cast member again and I'm so excited. I'm going to be a photographer at Hollywood Studios and I am super duper, super duper excited. So that's the update for us. We are in Florida. We are currently living with some friends until we get a place of our own and we are super thankful that they are letting us live with them for the time being. And yeah, that's the update for now. So I just want to give you guys a quick update. And as far as videos goes, I'm still going to be uploading. I'm not sure the consistency because I am going to be full time during the summer because of the summer.